Good evening, guys. It's Friday night. Tomorrow, we take on Swindon Town at the race course. Or, if you want to get technical, the Stoke Ras in a three o'clock kickoff. They're 10th, we're 11th, both on four points. My predictions, team lineups, and score coming up on This Is Wrexham, and this bugger is the early show. like please subscribe to these videos thank you for all your support guys it means i means the world i'm just i'm buzzing with all the feet well 99 percent because i do get the odd idiot membership shout outs red army level the absolute legends we have wayne cram we have logan leroy and we have jay i think it's upper east side hawk i think it's that man and he oh well, i know it is and he's an absolute legend thank you very much guys come on you reds Welcome to the early show, guys. I am your host, Sean Winter, but obviously by now, I would have thought you knew that. Okay, I tell you what, Wrexham were fantastic in the week, weren't they? If you would have heard the last show of me and James, which I thought was a cracker, by the way, um, Wrexham were absolutely fantastic, weren't they? We praised them to high heavens, and rightly so. That team did us proud. Passion, bite, vigour. It had a lot the fight was there, the passion was there, oh, it was beautiful, it was poetry, emotion, and I'm getting excited for tomorrow already. It's got the hallmarks of an absolute classic, as my friend the bootlegger would say. Okay, so my lineup versus Walsall, I was two players out, but one of those players was injured, so I think I'm going to get the nail on the head this time. So, in goal, super Ben Foster in goal, he was absolutely tremendous the other night. Guys, how good was he? He was awesome. Self-assured, honestly. Oh, cool, calm, collected. Ben, you're a diamond. For the start again, because what a game. Same back three. O'Connell, Toza, Boyle. You can't, you can't shift. And Mendy has to start on the left, guys, because he has started the season. <whistles> that man is at it. Mean Machine Mendy, we should be calling him. Absolutely terrific start to the season, Mendy. And he's look, he looks powerful and he looks tough to stop. Again, I'm going to go with the same midfield. Because I thought he were absolutely excellent. And I don't see how he can change that. JJ on the right of the three. Super captain Luke Young in the middle. Captain Marvel himself. I think he's won his place back big time. And I think he's going to become the first name on the team sheet again. You know, uh, flashbacks to last season when he was just terrific. When does he let us down? He just doesn't, does he? Unbelievable. And then that man on the left. Who else can you have? It's Elliot Lee. It's Elliot Lee. It's the only one man. I thought he was a magician the other night. Absolute magician. What a player. What a man. Tenacious. Tenacity. He's at him. He's, oh, he's snarling. Fantastic. As you can see, I'm excited because I think we're going to get another three points. Up front, Palm and Bickerstaff. Yes, okay, the eagle eye viewer will know I haven't changed the bloody lineup. Well, why would you? I don't know why it's Stephen, why would you change the lineup? You wouldn't, is the uh, is the correct term, unless someone's got a bit of a knock. That team the other night done us proud. Awesome, brilliant, fantastic. Um I've got no more superlatives left. Do you like that one, Steve? Eh? I'm not as thick as I look. Um uh, absolutely tremendous from Wrexham. So yeah, Swindon Town sit in tenth place. They're on four points. However, they've played a game less than Wrexham, who sit 11th. Um, but they're doing their homework. They have got to be wary because Wrexham look a decent outfit back at home. I think the race course is going to be a fortress. I think the race course is going to be rocking again tomorrow afternoon. Um, and I think Wrexham are going to come away with the three points. And I'm going to go 3 0. I'm going to go 3 0. Oh, maybe 3 1. 3 0. Rex him to shut out tomorrow. And I fancy Ollie Palmer and Bickers to get back on that scoreline. And possibly Elliot Lee as well. Um, I'm buzzing for the game. Uh, I don't even know if I'll be able to watch it because Lenny's got a tournament. So I'm going to ask to ask Tommy Kaus if he can do some video diaries for me. If he's not too busy. Thank you for listening to that video. I tell you what, I'm not getting bad at this, am I? Well, all right, leave your comments to yourself. Thank you very much. Goodbye for now. I'll be back Saturday night telling you how we've won three points against Swindon Town at the race course. Passion's oozing. Come on, Evan Army!